welcome all of you so let's uh, begin it our uh, next error in our uh, tutorial session of possible errors and its solution during the development of IASA jobs so before this already we have discussed the three different kind of errors uh, which generally occurs in the development of IACS now today we are going to discuss about the most uh, popular and uh, most worried concern error for the IACS developer during the development of IACS job and that is nothing but the uh, DTM error okay which stands for the data transformation manager error so here you can see the error which I have mentioned here the DTM process terminated unexpectedly contact to the Informatica global support so today we'll discuss about what is the reason behind that and how we can resolve this kind of error okay so uh, let's see the <coughs> details about this so when you get this error uh, generally you will get this kind of uh, what you can say the the picture or image uh, in your uh, instance of the mapping so here you can see the message being mentioned here the internal error the DTM process terminated unexpectedly contact Informatica global customer support now why I am considering this as a most concerned or worried error for Informatica developers or Informatica developers always uh, worried concern and afraid about the resolving this error okay the main reason behind uh, why I am saying this is what because related with the other kind of errors the specific reason uh, used to be mentioned here like uh, numeric value uh, not found uh, which is related to the data type mismatch or uh, another kind of uh, errors like uh, what we can say uh, the connection not found etc etc okay but here in this kind of error there is a no specific reason is mentioned directly it is mentioned the DTM process terminately unexpectedly and you need to contact your uh, Informatica admin to resolve this error and also in the logs also the specific reasons are not mentioned for this error so that is the reason the developers not able to understand how to uh, find the root cause analysis RCA for this kind of errors okay so that's why it is a most concern and uh, uh, time consuming uh, uh, error to resolve okay so uh, let's see the reason behind that what the what can be the possible now uh, related with the reason uh, there are we cannot say these are the specific reason where because DTM error can be occur because of multiple uh, reasons so today we'll discuss some of the reasons and uh, we'll focus on one common reason uh, and how to resolve that okay related with the DTM so why this ger error generally occurs so here I have mentioned the DTM which stands for the data transformation manager error in Informatica usually indicates an issue with the session or workflow execution so uh, your session or workflow uh, not able to execute properly because of uh, some issue in your uh, mapping okay and because of that what happened the data transformation manager which is a main component of your Informatica not able to process your mapping okay so as I said there are uh, some common reason for DTM errors and uh, so let's see the uh, reasons for the DTM error one by one okay so first reason can be the resource issue resource in the sense the hardware related things like your CPU memory disk space so if these uh, uh, resources are not available in the uh, adequate form or adequate form in the sense if the CPU is less CPU configuration less uh, or memory is less or disk space is less uh, less in the sense uh, uh, if it is not in the uh, uh, what you can say uh, it is not satisfying the requirement for IAC jobs to be executed uh, then uh, we can say there is a resource issue okay if the CPU requirement is a 16 GB and you if you are running on the 4 GB like these kind of things or memory is not enough or this space is not enough okay so uh, if, if, if this kind of things are there then can there also the DTM error can occur so first issue I have mentioned ensure that there are enough system resources like CPU memory disk space available DTM error can occur if the server is overloaded okay so if many jobs are running and for your job the this this uh, uh, CPU memory disk space is not enough then the DTM error can also occur okay 
next is the connection problem suppose you are using some uh, oracle connection for example in the source and that connection is not in the active state so uh, your informatica will not able to access your uh, database properly so that because of that also this error can occur so second error i have mentioned the connection problems so in order to avoid this error you have to check the connection properly for source target or lookup and make sure that connection details are correct and the database are accessible okay so this can be the second reason third reason related with the permission so uh, you have if if the certain permission uh, for your job ex executions are uh, not given okay or necessary permission to access the database and files are not there for particular user, user then this error can also occur for example uh, if you are don't act, don't have the access to access the database tables or if you don't have the access to flat files then uh, so these are the permission issues so if you don't have the permission then for that particular user the dtm error can also occur okay so this is the third reason and fourth and most common reason uh, which generally occurs in the development of iics is the mapping errors so in the mapping errors can be a different like there can be a data type mismatch there can be a precision mismatch there can be a invalid expression multiple reasons can be there okay so related to the mapping errors today we are going to focus on the uh, one of the issue related with the uh, precision mismatch okay so here i have given the example in the lookup condition where you are comparing the two fields for example in the lookup condition incoming field precision doesn't match with your lookup field precision so then this error will definitely occur and this is the most common uh mistake might happen from the iics development and this is the most popular reason for the dtm error during the iics development okay so reason is what if you are using the lookup and your incoming and in and in, in the lookup uh, condition your incoming field precision is not matching with your lookup field precision okay then this error will definitely occur okay so here in the screenshot i have shown so for the our uh, example we have the lookup field id and you are comparing it with the incoming field id and your lookup field id precision is 10 and lookup field uh, sorry incoming field id precision is the 38 so there is a mismatch in the precision of lookup field and the incoming field id and because of this this error will definitely occur okay so this is the main reason that is occur because of the precision mismatch even if the data type mismatch also there this kind of error might occur okay so this is the uh, mapping error because of which the data transformation manager not able to process your mapping not able to execute your mapping uh, in the sense your session and workflow and uh, the reason is what this kind of issue precision mismatch okay now how we can resolve this uh, fourth kind of issue so today we are focusing on the fourth uh, ma uh, issue because of which dtm can occur now there is a simple solution for this you have to make sure the precision and data type uh, of your field which you are using in the lookup condition that should be matching with each other okay so so if your precision of your lookup field is 38 and precision of your precision of your incoming field is the 38 so they are matching with each other they are exactly same so you will not get any kind of dtm error in this case okay so uh, i hope all of you understood this theoretical part what is the dtm error reason behind that and how to resolve this okay now let's uh, move towards the uh, demonstration okay so in the demo part i will show you uh, how this error generally occurs okay and how we can resolve it okay now let me first uh, make some changes so that you will get the dtm error okay so here I am making changes uh, you know intentionally to understand the DTM error so this kind of uh, mistake might be happen uh, unintentionally from the developers ok so just I am make going to the edit metadata and now I am changing this precision to 10 ok ok now I am saving this now you can see uh, this is the field from the lookup id field ok and 
it's having its precision 10 okay now if you go to the lookup condition here we are comparing comparing the uh, in uh, lookup field id and incoming field i id okay now as i shown you the this lookup field id is having the precision 10 but the field which is coming from incoming that is having the precision of 38 here you can see so there is a precision mismatch so definitely after running the job we should get the dtm error okay because in the lookup condition these precisions are not matching so let me run this and let's see what result we will get so our job is running let's see So you can see our job has failed and let's see the reason so reason is the dtm error now there is no specific reason mentioned that like precision is not matching etc even if you go to the logs now let's see what is mentioned in the logs so in the logs also you will not get the specific reason specific reason so let's see what is mentioned in the logs So you can see in the logs it is mentioned that invalid lookup condition. Okay, so we are getting some idea, some uh, in case of some errors. So here it is mentioned data type for the port is not matching. But data type, let me show you the data types are matching itself, but not the precision. Okay, so data type of this return field ID is a decimal only, and incoming field is the decimal only. Okay, so uh, you know so. Informatica is uh, cloud not giving the specific reason giving the related reason but in case of some uh, you know uh, some errors in this related uh, related uh, things also not mentioned in the logs okay related with the DTM error okay now I hope all of, you, all of you got what is the reason now let's try to resolve this so simple solution is there to resolve this okay we simply change the data type to 38 so that the two fields which you are comparing in the lookup condition they are having the matching precision okay so here lookup field id is having the 38 and also incoming field id is having the 38 okay now let's run this so after running this you should not get any kind of dtm error so you can see our job has executed successfully without any kind of error okay because the reason which which was there related to the precision mismatch that we have uh, that we have changed and we have make the precision same for both of the fields okay so so that's uh, all about uh, today's session okay related with the dtm errors so today we have seen what is dtm error what are the possible reason and how we can solve it okay i hope all of you understood this part and let's meet in the next video okay thanks all of you